What is up YouTube, Dramatello here, and today I'm gonna give you a little tip uh, that could uh, potentially save your experience in games like Elden Ring. I heard this is the same with Sekiro, or I don't know, like maybe other FromSoft games, and potentially other games in general, right? Um, uh, what happens uh, in this uh, file backup system, which you have with your Windows, if you have Windows 10, surely there's something similar in uh, Windows 11. Uh, this is an automatic backup that can, by my own personal settings, I set it to backup my files every hour uh, to a USB drive. So I, I uh, entered my USB drive, and here, if you'll go to basically uh, files backup, you can go from, like, if you just click here on the search bar, and you will click um, uh, backup, you will get to these settings. So instead of all of this, you will actually have uh, where you can pick the drive where you want to back up your files. And what you're gonna do, you're gonna add those files. And then you will go to more options. When you'll go to more options, basically you're gonna see a lot of different folders. Okay, a lot of different folders. Um, you wanna remove them, because I don't see any reason to back them up, but if you wanna keep them, then by all means keep them. And what you want to do is uh, you want to add these folders, okay? Uh, the saved games, I don't know, this was here by default. I thought, whatever, like, I don't know, maybe maybe it saves some game files. I don't know what that is. But uh, if you go to app data slash roaming, this is the folder you basically want to back up, okay? Because under roaming, you will have Elden, Rings, um, Elden Ring uh, saved files. And these are the files you want to back up. Next up here, you will have the options you want to put on the backup. So you want to back up your files every hour, but believe it or not, you can do it even more frequent if you want to. Okay, you don't have to, but you can do that. To me, one hour is okay because imagine I play Elden Ring, right? I play the game. Let's say uh, my files are being corrupted uh, because I don't know, I had like a power a shutdown or something or my computer re reset it or something happened uh and to me losing an hour of grinding is not that that big of a deal but you can definitely do something more frequent that's fine um maybe i'll change it to 30 minutes who cares anyways uh you can keep your backups for as long as you want so this is like say for a month or maybe you want to go back three months to me one month is fine okay i don't need it that long okay um and then what happens is say your files are corrupted right what you're going to do you're going to click the restore files from current backup and once you once you click that you will see don't mind the hebrew but barely basically this is like the date right so here where you have the date you can basically run through different times of these these files right and so if you want to back up, say, from this date, whoa, lost a little focus there, uh, you want to uh, restore from a specific date, what you want to do is you first you go to Steam, you click the game you're going to be loading the saved files for, you go to Properties, you turn this down, you, you shut this down, keep game saved on cloud. You want to turn this down because what's going to happen if you're going to play it's going to take the saved file, uh, which is the most updated, which is probably the one that is on the cloud. So you want to shut that down for now. Okay, this is just for now. This is temporary. You close it. You restore the file. You go to Elden Ring. You restore this folder. Okay. You click here, restore to original location. It will basically uh, copy the file. Um, and you will have uh, the, the files that are not corrupted. Hopefully you're loading the files that are good now. You load the game. You advance a little in the game. You don't have to do something crazy. You can do just whatever, like, um, like uh, do, a little, do, do, some, do some stuff, whatever. Like go to like a different uh, um, uh, enemy spot or something, kill a bunch of enemies. And then quit the game as it sh as you should, which is from the escape. And then in the settings, you go to uh, quit the game. You're quitting the game. You know the files are fine now. You click here, properties again. 
and then you turn this back on okay and now the most updated file which is now what you loaded plus your little changes you did in the game which is basically the right files now so now you're saved from being a miserable tarnished maidenless dude who just lost or dude or a girl whatever uh who lost a lot of hours of gameplay and you just saved it and you're good uh you're welcome do this uh as often as possible if you're starting the game or whatever but this is very important see you later guys